what is up there everybody welcome back to another youtube video it's hero here, here and today i'm going to show you guys how to do this minecraft command block which is the explosive jump punch here in minecraft bedrock edition but before start and before we get right into the video you know the drill give a like this video if you do like this video also hit the subscribe button right now down below and slap that notification bell icon and always be notified every time we upload such video and stuff but now guys let's go right to it and let's get started Alright, just like you see in the thumbnail and in the title, we're gonna do the explosive jump punch here in Minecraft Bedrock. So basically what we're gonna do is this kind of item. So the item is just random and you can just choose any kind of items in your inventory. Just like this and or like this. So you can just rename it using the anvil. For example, we choose this feather and what we actually do to the feather is um, go to the anvil or go to an anvil and rename the feather into jump underscore punch and after that we're gonna have to separate all the items since we only need one item at a time so we're gonna have to separate them like this and all to do is drop the item but first let's put a target which is a pig and drop the rename item and as you can see i got teleported near to the uh, creatures and create a massive explosive punch but before we continue the um showcase let me just remove all this command box and uh, command box feedback so i'm gonna do is do slash game rule and command block output and put it to false and next do it again twice slash game rule and for this i'm gonna do the command box send command feedback and put it to false and now we're done to that let's just continue the showcase all right i'm never gonna show you uh, i haven't shown you anything yet so all you actually do is drop the item and as you can see you get teleported and boom you get actually get blown by your own punch so good thing we have this the slow falling effects formerly five seconds and so do the regeneration effects here you go you get actually teleported and boom that is your super punch actually gonna blow you away right to the mid air but you have the my five seconds regeneration and the five seconds slow falling so this thing actually teleports you to your target and create the massive explosive punch until your target get killed so it doesn't actually um usually works to one punch all the um sturdy creatures such as iron golems and the ender dragon or any other bosses so you can actually just one punch them but for this creature you can actually just one punch them here you go and boom ah that's one strong punch so that strong punch actually uh, repel us right to the mid airs that, so that's the reason why i put the slow falling effects all right let's do it again for this task and let me get my item so this item is just like some sort of ammo so the item get killed every time you use um the uh, command block so if it won't get killed you're gonna create a lot of massive like massive crash in your world so you better do it you better follow the commands okay so drop the item as you can see you get teleported near to it and get punched and blown away all right here we go again drop the item and as you can see you get teleported near to it and get blown away by the punch and now you see all of that let's go right into the commands so we have our first command which is a repeating command so we need this for task for at the name calls jump underscore punch which is the rename item so we're gonna put the command to repeat uncontrol and need rest on so as you can see this is all the item which we renamed the jump punch so you're gonna test for this item whenever we drop it and it will activate all this chain of command blocks so just like that so that part is actually a recent departure so it's important to be recent departure in that part and able to continue the circulation of the um electricity and this part is we have the impulse command I'm gonna do the execute at p name equals hero over play title tp two arrow two and one arrow so you have to put your own name on it don't follow my name so you're gonna put your own username and this part is a redstone repeater and we have your redstone particle which is the knockback underscore or underscore particle so you put your own name into the execute at the name and put it in post anchor and the redstone now this part is another chain command so we actually just would create like a big chain of electricity here and this part is gonna tp right to do um to the instant phase of Two arrow three and without space two arrow so you're gonna put execute that being equals hero over play so you put your own name on it okay and this part is another rest and repeater and this part is another minecraft rest and particle so we're gonna put knackback underscore roar underscore particle that command just like the other one and this part is the one of the most important parts so this one is just a rest and repeater and this one is the four um qm pile up 
we have your execute at p put your own name on it don't follow mine 3 dollar tp 3 r one facing at the name cost um put apostrophe hero overplay comma type cost apostrophe item comma to register 88 and comma c equals one so the the way i put the apostrophe in it so you won't get actually affect by the commands and also the items and so i'm gonna give you the regeneration effect so you put your own name on it chain actual and always active this one is slow falling for five seconds so you're gonna put, you're gonna have to put your own name okay chain actual and always active and this part is the dragon underscore under, uh, destroy underscore block particle so this is the final particle which whenever you create a massive strong punch where you get pulled back to mid-air that's the final particle that we have and this part is under impulse command so if you execute that p name was here about play so you put your own name Trittle the execute at e to raises of three. Trittle the human ender underscore crystal. Trittle the Minecraft crystal underscore explode. And there we have it. So that's the secret of the massive strong punch, which actually pull you back to the mid air. And this one is a resin torch. And we put to the top you another resin, which gonna kill the item, which we rename into jump underscore punch, enable to um evade or enable to stop the lag or the crush of the world. You have to prevent that no matter what. Okay. And this is what happen if you're, you don't have a target nearby to raise of 88. You're just gonna get like, like jumping punch in it. So you need the target and able to go near into it. So it's like teleporting just like that, okay? But anyway guys, I think that will be it for our video today. Hope you enjoy and if you like this video, always give a like, subscribe, and slap the notification bell so you can always be notified every time we upload this such video and stuff. Also follow me at Twitter. Follow my Facebook and my TikTok account. So if you wanna do or if you have time, feel free. Okay. Thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy. And I'm gonna do another Minecraft man block and stay tuned for my live stream. But guys, I think that will be it for our video. Love you all. Peace out. Bye bye. And see you next time.